Turn on light one. Sure, turning the light one on. Turn on light two. Sure, turning the light two on. Turn off light two. All right, turning the light two off. The components required for this experiment are ESP32 board, 4 channel relay, connecting wires, connecting cable and 4 bulbs. Now log into the Arduino IoT Cloud website. Here enter the username and password and click on the sign in button. Here from the left side menu, click Things. Here click plus Thing button. We can rename this thing to Home Automation with Google Assistant and ESP32 and click on the rename button. Now click on the add button and add four variables. Enter the first variable name as light1. Select the variable type as smart home. Scroll down and select switch. And now click add variable button. Now again click add and enter the variable name as light2. Again select the variable type as smart home and select switch. Click add variable. Likewise add the rem remaining two variables light 3 and light 4. Now we need to select the device. So under associated device Select device. Here uh, select setup new device and then select third party device. Here we are using ESP32 board. So here select ESP32 and select the model as ESP32 DAO module and click continue. Here we can give any device name. Now click next. Here select this checkbox and copy the secret key and click continue and then finally click done. Now we need to configure the network. So here click the configure button under network, enter the Wi-Fi username and password and here paste the secret key which we copied and click the save button. Now click the configure button under smart home integration. So here click configure and select connect to Google home. 
and here uh, select the got it button now go to this menu and select dashboards here click this plus dashboard button here rename the dashboard to home automation with google assistant and click the rename button now here we need to add four switch widgets click switch here give the name as switch one click link variable and link with the so this is our thing select our thing and link with the light one variable and then click the link variable button and click done again click add click switch here give the name as switch two click link variable select our thing and uh, link with light to variable button and click done now the third one add switch here give the name as uh, switch 3 click link variable uh, select our thing and link with light 3 and click done now the final one add switch the name is switch 4 link variable select thing link with light 4 variable and click done now again go back to the menu and go to things now click our thing which is home automation with google assistant and esp32 here go to sketch now here you can see the basic template is generated and we need to add the logic so declare these uh, variables switch 1 2 3 and 4 so this is the connection so connect the in1 pin from the relative pin 18 in2 to 19 in3 to 22 and in4 to 23 so pin mode is output so on light one change so this is the condition so if the switch one button is pressed so this will work so switch one will be turn on high if not it will be in low and for light two so this will be change this to light two and change switch one to switch two this is for light three so switch three will be high so if not switch three will be low and the final one if light 4 if the uh, switch 4 button is pressed so switch 4 will be high this will be low so this is our program now click this upload button and upload the program to the ESP32 board now the program is successfully uploaded to the ESP32 board now we can set up the Google Home application. For that, download the Google Home application from the Play Store. Once you log in, you will get the screen like this. Now go to Devices. So here click Add Device and select Works with Google Home. Here search for Arduino. Select Arduino and click Continue. Now we need to link our Arduino IoT cloud account with Google Home. So enter the username and password which you created for Arduino IoT cloud. Now the Arduino IoT cloud account is linked with Google Home application. Now you can see the four uh, devices which we added in the Arduino IoT cloud is also displaying in the Google Home application. Now go back to the main page. And here you can see the uh, four switches under devices menu. Now we can check the output. Turn on light one. Sure, turning the light one on. Turn on light two. Sure, turning the light two on. Turn on light 3. Alright, turning on the light 3. 
Turn on light 4. Okay, turning on the light 4. Turn off light 2. All right, turning the light 2 off. Turn off light 1. Got it. Turning the light 1 off. Turn off light 3. Sure, turning the light 3 off. Turn off light 4. Okay, turning off the light 